Hey guys, so I'm really, really excited to film this because I haven't been able to film hauls recently because I haven't had a tripod and now I finally have one so I'm going to show you guys what I got at this store called Daiso. And there are some Daisos in the States. I know there's one in Berkeley and there's one in San Jose or somewhere else in the Bay in California as well. But it is a 100 yen store, so kind of like a dollar store if you put it in American terms. But to me, I feel like they have a lot of different stuff that they don't, like dollar stores don't carry. So I'm going to show you what I got. And it's all very exciting because I can finally film my hauls now. Anyway, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. The first things I got are makeup things. So I'm going to show you all four of the things. Okay, so I got this rose jewelry lip gloss, and it's really pretty. Let me zoom in on it really quick, because I'm not sure if you can see this rose. So the shape of the lip gloss at the bottom is like this, like a rose, and then this is the top, the lid part. So I thought they were both really pretty, and I got them in four different colors, so I'm going to zoom out really quick. So I got four different colors, and let me show you them right now. It is happy pink. It is. They are. Soft Scarlet, Rich Red, and lastly, Fresh Peach. So I do plan on doing a giveaway for these items, so stay tuned for that, but I will be filming them probably when I get back to the States, because I don't want to pay for shipping from Japan to America when I live in America, because I think that's kind of pointless. So I'll be back in like two weeks, and you should stay tuned for those, because I'll probably be giving like two of those away. Um, next thing that I got is this. These are hair clips, and I like how, like, they're plastic, but they don't snag your hair, so you can keep your bangs out of the way while you wash your face or something. It's pretty utilitarian. Um, I got these earrings right here, and they're really pretty. They have these, like, pearl clusters at the top. I'm having issues speaking today. And it has a gold chain going down the middle, so I thought that was pretty. I bought chopsticks, because... I use chopsticks when I eat, and these just happen to be Hello Kitty ones, so I thought they were really pretty. Really pretty? I thought they were cute. So I think I'll bring these to college and eat with this. <laughs> and then I bought three pairs of eyelashes. I actually bought more for my friends and stuff, but I'll just show you the ones I got because they're just doubles of everything that I got. So here's the first pair, and they're crossed, I think. Yeah, they're crossed type with glitter in the band, so I thought that was kind of interesting, like, you know, party night out kind of lashes and then these come with two pairs by the way for 105 yen so like a dollar and then these I thought were really interesting because there's less in the insides and the more on the outsides I did talk about this while I was there so if you guys want to check that out you can click right here but for those of you that are just watching the haul this one's interesting because it has like less on the inside here and then more volume on the outside so it looks a little bit more natural even though they are cross type Generally, I don't like cross-type lashes, but Japanese people seem to only like those because I only see those everywhere I go. And then this is called Daily Cross, so a little bit more natural, I guess. It's like short, long, short, long, alternating lashes. So, the next item that I got, the last makeup item that I got is this right here, and this is a mascara base. Um, if you've ever tried something like Maybelline's Extra Extra Long or XXL, I don't know what it stands for. It has like that white primer side and then it has the black side, the mascara side. So this is just like a mascara base basically, similar to that. But I know that these work really well, like I've tried them before and they work so well for me so just decided to get it. Um, the next things that I got are right here. It is so hot in this room. I have the AC running and... The AC is actually like right above me right there, so that all the air is going behind me and I can't feel anything, so it's really hot. Sorry. Um, the next things that I got are these four pens right here, and these are actually my all-time favorite pens ever. Like, I use them on IB testing. I use one entire pen, like all of the ink during IB, IB testing, and these are just like really smooth and they don't leave ink blots, and ink blots are like my all-time pet peeve, like biggest pet peeve ever. So these are really nice. I actually bought three sets of these colors because I know that they work really well and I haven't seen these colors in the States. I know that there's like black and red and blue in the Daiso in Berkeley, but meh. So um, I also bought this pen right here. This is a cell phone strap pen and it's a Hello Kitty pen. 
And what you do is you take it out of here and then you switch it around and it gets longer. So like that right there. So you can stick it on your cell phone or stick it in your purse or something and it's something you'll never lose, you know, like for me personally, I'm always digging around to find a pen so it's really nice for me to see one of those like cell phone strap things where you can just stick it on your purse or on your cell phone and then you'll always have a pen handy. And then the next thing that I got is this. This is a card case. So I always have a lot of like gift cards or you know those like frozen yogurt cards where you get like a stamp every time you go and you know get something so I always like try to stick those all in my wallet and then my wallet gets really fat and I don't like that so this is just something to carry all those cards around and then these things are really interesting so I always get like really crazy about dieting when I'm in Japan because everyone is pretty thin and I'm not so thin so um, I got this <laughs> These are sauna suits and Japanese people like to take baths even in the summertime so what you do is you wear this while you're in the bath and um, you only fill up the bathtub like halfway and you're supposed to sweat a lot so it's supposed to promote like healthy sweating and then you can like stretch afterwards because you'll be really nice and limber and stuff. So this is pants and then this is the jacket so I'll try these and tell you you know how they were but I don't know, I just thought it was kind of interesting, so I decided to get it, and it's only 100 yen anyway. And then, the next three things that I got are leggings, because I love getting leggings in Japan. So I bought three pairs, and this one is the gray one. And I'm a size medium to large, or SM, small to medium, but they usually don't carry a small medium, so I just got the ML. And it fits, like, fine. The leg is a little bit long, but it's, yeah, it's like, I can deal with it, you know? So this is the gray one. This is the, it says purple, it says dark purple, but I think this is more like navy blue. Maybe if it stretches out a little bit more, it'll be a little bit more purple in color. And then this one, I think, is the most purplish. It's kind of like a maroon, brown type of color. And then the last item that I got is actually for my friend, because when he went to Hong Kong, I think, he bought me something. So I got him this ninja mask. Um... It's supposed to like, you're supposed to put your face in it and then you'll look like that right there. So I thought it was kind of funny, like a gag gift. So yeah, that is the end of my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it with all of its randomness and whatever. And I will be posting more hauls to come, so stay out for, stay, stay looking out for those. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Um, comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!